Hi, this is Mark, and I am here with a custom subsystem design, a precision inclinometer based on Murata's SCA-103T. The SCA-103T-D04 has a range of plus or minus 15 degrees and a resolution of 0.001 degrees when limited to a bandwidth of 10 Hz. The IC has a built-in 11-bit analog-to-digital converter that is used primarily to calibrate the device. To achieve the full precision of the device, an external ADC must be added to the design. In this case, the LTC 2380 IDE-24, a 24-bit successive approximation register ADC by Linear Technologies. I realize that the 24-bit resolution falls below the noise floor and many bits will have to be discarded. But since I only made one board, I wanted to test the upper limits of resolution. The digital averaging filter can retain up to 65,535 readings and compute the mean of the values. This creates a type of finite impulse response filter. If anyone ever replicates the circuit, there's a 16-bit pin-compatible replacement for the analog-to-digital converter. Redesign is as simple as changing a part number on the bill of materials. Physical stresses on the voltage reference caused by board expansion due to heat and humidity changes can affect the output voltage. To minimize the amount of expansion, this section of the PCB is mechanically isolated from the rest of the PCB. These cutouts are suggested by the manufacturer's data sheet. I created an adjustable board holder that is theoretically capable of one thousandth of a degree of adjustment through the use of a differential adjustment screw. Differential adjustment screws are compound screws that provide microfine adjustment over a very short range. These screws function by simultaneously affecting two threads that have a slightly different pitch. As one screw advances, the other screw retreats. The result is a movement that is the difference of the two screw pitches. Data is read off the ADC's SPI interface with an MSP430 FR2633 MCU and sent via UART to the Silicon Lab CP2102N UART to USB converter. Once the data is moved off the board, I plan to visualize and interpret the data with Wolfram's Mathematica. There are several parts to this subsystem design project. Visit allaboutcircuits.com to learn more.